What's up, duelers? It's Nerp here, and I streamed this game for seven hours today. So if you want, go check that out. Uh, closed beta starts with this, so there was a huge reset. Um, all the cards in your collection were reset. Now there's an armor where you can buy packs, very similar to Hearthstone. Uh, Hearthstone's prices for packs, and everything was reset. Um, new challenges, tutorials, stuff like that and my elite rank zero went away um but i'm down to 18 already because i've been playing a lot today and also hey why is it saying no gauntlet wins yeah for some reason they didn't reset the total wins i don't know but gauntlet i in the stream if you want to check that out on the nerf streams youtube channel where i have all the vods uh i had an eight win gauntlet run i went eight and three uh see so if you want you can check that out um so yeah, so it's a seven hour stream, they're split into two videos. Some duelist veterans helped me out. So, yeah, what we're gonna do today is, so I have I have a Lionar deck and a Retrieving deck. My Lionar deck is very similar to my Lionar deck before the reset. Um, only difference is I have like a couple of these legendaries. And then I have, uh, like I don't have any of the the arc light uh, artifact things that stop two damage on the general and increases attack by two. Those are legendaries. I don't have those anymore. The packs uh, did not have them for me. And then um, I've been mostly using this, but I just started. I've, I'm like 4 0 in rank so far with this deck, which is my Vitruvian deck. So I started playing a bit of Vitruvian, and. It's been pretty good. It's low on creatures, something that doesn't get much of a start, but then you can get some super powerful blast in your general, and it's really fun. Uh, I have not really an optimal Vitruvian deck as much as my Lionar deck, because I'm missing like a lot of crucial cards. Like You really want 3 Stars Fury, um, 3 Mara Healers, like 3 Wildfire Anks, probably. But, whatever. It's been working out okay so far and that's what I'm, we're gonna do in this video so let's go with uh, my custom Vitruvian deck and we're gonna have oh it's Blinky <laughs> what a surprise um, I'm gonna play a two drop and I'm going to keep this starting hand <laughs> that's funny <laughs> we have a Blinky Vitruvian mirror match Okay, so he plays that up for oh that's that's a big turn one play because that means my guy, but I will be able to play a wildfire ink, which will be able to destroy him. I'm gonna keep my hand. Awesome, and I get a scarab. Okay, so far so good. See what uh, Blinky um, has in his Vitruvian deck. Oh, Portal Gun. Those are pretty uh, important cards for Vitruvian. But unfortunately, I, I have a. I didn't have any. I made two with Spirit. Okay, now he's a bit scary. I'll stay away from that. Or I could destroy it with a uh, Entropic Decay. Hmm. And that's actually what I'm going to do. I'm just going to destroy it with this. And then I'm going to do some damage to him. Sorry about that, guys. And that will be my turn. Some dispel stuff, some spells. Yeah, so Mr. Vitruvian, unlike Lionar, it really doesn't have as many creatures to play. It kind of just like lots of artifacts, lots of spells. That's good to counter the, my artifact. Provoke other minions, you summon the certain team plus one. Okay. So there's a lady lock. But just not really that threatening on her own. I will play. Um, do I want to spell it? I don't know. 
I play this, then I can destroy that. Um, and then I have some mana left over. The spell is pretty good against Vitruvian. Let's play this. Then I'll play that. And I'll play this right here. So now I'm going to start getting my dervishes before he does. I get signs for a swish and a silhouette tracer. Neither of our generals has blast right now. I am at a blast range, so if he has a uh, the ink, ah oh, man, so that thing is just gonna be a zero six sitting there. And now there's that. I think I'll dispel that though. Um, let's see if I can find or starfire Seraph isn't too bad. Um, hmm. This tough choice, though. I don't think I want to get rid of anything. I'm going to play a scare if he can just move towards it. That's the problem. I'll go like this. I'll go to the sides. Blast is better for the sides, I think. And I could give it plus one one. Next turn I'll have seven to work with, which I can play everything here. So I'm not going to do anything with that. I get another Pyromancer and another Silhouette Tracer. Okay, our hand looks pretty symmetrical here, but <laughs> yeah. So pretty close starting out. I hope uh, that my Starfire Scarab can get an attack off and I can use the Signs for Swish to make it have 5 attack and be able to destroy this Amara healer. That is ideal. Alright, nice. He's just gonna hit that even though it's dispelled. Hopefully he can't dispel this. That would, uh, throw a wrench into my plans. And is he just going to take this out? I mean, no reason not to if he doesn't have anything else to hit with his general. And a portal guardian. So that thing's a threat. So I could play this and really get somewhere with the silhouette trace. I have to run away probably. And a Sarlacc. Okay, so. First things first, I think I definitely want to give this 5 attack. Yeah. And I get blast on my general. Okay, so now... I'll move up. I will dispel this. So now I don't get dealt 5 damage. He doesn't get healed by 5 damage. Um, I can give my general blast, which doesn't do a whole lot right now. Let's see. If I move four spaces, one, two, three. Get all the way over there. Hmm. Yeah, let's play this. Let's get you out of here. farther preferably and a pyromancer and I think that's good okay so now sorry that was my Facebook don't go check any notifications <laughs> um, I have a stars fury which is a pretty staple card in Vitruvian but I don't know 
So at least uh, he can get to me with his frenzy guy. And he really needs to deal with this five attack blast. If he has some kind of dispel, he'd need to use that. I have another way to get my general blast. I really would like to draw the thing that gives me plus three attack. So now they're provoked. Unfortunately, if I play Star's Fury, now this has something in front of it, so I can't get a Dervish there. Hmm. I'm really not replacing this game, because I feel like I want to keep these Pyromancers, but not doing a whole lot. Okay, well, at least um, I didn't play the artifact yet, but he does destroy that. Okay, my turn. So how many dervishes can I get if I play this? One, two, three. Hmm. Let's get rid of one of the sil silhouette tracers. I can do that, right? Uh, yeah. Another Starfire Scarab. Okay, if I get you down here, I can deal five damage to that. And then that would be... Two more. Okay, let's play Star's Fury. So, I'm gonna kill this. Move you down. Five damage there. Oh, provoked? I didn't realize I'm provoked. In that case, I'm going to get away from here. And I could have done more that turn, I think. Not a whole lot more. Nice that I provoke. Yeah, that wasn't too bad, but I could have probably... Oh, I had more... Re if I had more time there, I would have played a Silhouette Tracer. And then... No, I mean, I wouldn't have enough mana for to play the Wildfire Ink then. I should have played... No, I guess I could have played the Wildfire Ink, but he's not hitting anything. Yeah, I guess what I did was fine. So he's doing one damage to that. Uh, and now it just spawns right there. I guess I could have played the Silhouette Tracer so I can get away from the Portal Guardian because now it can deal 5 damage to me. I deal 2 damage back to it, which would die to a Blast from either my General or the Pyromancer. So that's always a good thing. But he's going to take out my Pyromancer. But I can give my General Blast. My Yeah, I can give my General Blast, take out those guys. They can also... Deal 5 damage there. Okay, so that costs 2, 4, and then I can play this. Alright, it's looking good, guys. Looking real good. I guess I can get towards the action. And I will play you up here and I guess that this thing just because and boom he doesn't really have much going for him and I have a Siphon Energy to destroy this Sarlacc without having to keep respawning every single turn. Yeah, so he's kind of stuffed. I have a 
five attack blast, a four attack blast, two attack blast, and more things on the board. And slightly more health. He's gonna have to figure something out to climb back into this game. Oh, and now I have a Staff of the Occur, which increases my attack by three on my general. So then I can have two five attack blast guys. Oh, this might have been bad though. Be oh no, I can move this. Never mind. I forgot, I forgot. I can. Oh no, it's a structure. I can't move it. So I can't. So he moves in such a way. Star's Fury. Uh, nothing was in front. So he gets a really nice uh, Star's Fury. Is that finally dead? Well, it's going to die, yeah. So, he finally kills my big Starfire Scarab. Maybe I should have played around that Star's Fury. I don't know, it wasn't too bad. Is he gonna be able to destroy this? I hope not. Okay. Um, hmm. So, I can put 5 damage on the on his general, 2 damage on that, unfortunately I can't get the, my other dude to stay in the same place, so let's just move over with them. Do I dispel this, or do I save the dispel? No, I think I'm gonna dispel it. First of all, I think I'm going to... I should replace first. Three, three. So I can only play six. I can't play this, I don't need to play that. But I think I'm gonna save the rest of my hand. I'm not searching for any cards to play. Okay, so... Fireblaze Obelisk. Kill that. Give my general more attack. Dispel this and destroy it. And his general doesn't have blast, even though it has five attack. So we can't really use that too well. And as it stands, I have enough damage on the board to win next turn, especially with, I'm going to get two 3-3 three, three Dervish minions, unless he's able to stop these Obelisks. So I'm going to get two 3-3 three, three Dervishes, and then I'll have a 2 attack here, 4 attack, and 5 attack with Blast. So it's going to be hard for him to survive this coming turn. But he plays a Time Maelstrom. So that is, uh, I, have that, I have one of those cards on my deck. It used to be really OP people stay, um, uh, but it doesn't really do anything for him. So that's gonna be game. Actually, is it? Yeah, it's gonna be game. Oh no, it's his turn. I thought it was, I forgot the time master means he goes again. Okay, well that's going to. Oh boy, he's gonna eventually get a bunch of attacks in a row. Huh? This thing is five attack. The problem is I have five attack. If I didn't have five attack, he'd hit me a couple times. But he can't really afford to hit me because he would die. This is General Blast. And he's gonna destroy my Scarab. So definitely took advantage of the time rails from there. It basically gives all your units hilarity almost. Also like gives you more cards to draw and stuff like that. Um wow. He might that was a huge turn. Looks like it was really in my favor. Now he has a chance. Wow, we're both battling with the staffs and the wildfire. Oops, let's skip that. Alright, there is a Portal Guardian. He plays... I'd like to get my Time Maelstrom. Yeah, so he needs to play that. So that... Alright, so now my General's out of his range. But that's going to be game. Because I have a Silhouette Tracer. So I can move my... General and destroy his. Well played, Blinky. That was a... Uh, good Vitruvian mirror match so that's that uh, so guys do you like Vitruvian um, I think it's really fun to play with uh, 
So I'm going to keep ranking up with Vitruvian and Lionar. I'm not sure which faction I like more. Um, they're pretty different, so it's a nice change of pace. And I'll try to mix them up in my channel a lot. Maybe I'll try the other factions too. So that'll be it for today. Like the video if you enjoyed. Subscribe for more content. Follow on Twitch and Twitter. Especially Twitch because I did stream for 7 hours and I remember that. And if you missed that stream, you can go to the Nerp Streams uh, YouTube channel and watch it. And I got it. A long judgment. A long gauntlet run. And uh, I was with Acro Tor, whatever. I think that was his name. And um, Duran Reb. They're like... Well, you probably know Duran Reb, but they're like uh, veteran duelist players. See you guys.